At long last, my new ABC LEN Master Module LCD unit is ready, and I'm ready to show it to you. This new module replaces the functionality of the original factory radio, which was the master unit, and the original blue and white LCD, segmented LCD, um, which is super bright at night. The uh, new unit uses the original module casing, but that's about it. The inside contains a new custom mount. It uses a Atmega 328P microcontroller to interface with the car's AVC LAN network. And it uses Raspberry Pi to do the um, visual, the graphic screen. The new LCD is a um, 1200 by 600 resolution, full color. And it performs all the original functions, all the necessary functions at least of the original LCD, and then even then more, some more. Um, there are a couple little things that still need to be fixed, such as, for example, it takes a couple seconds for the um, driver's side and passenger side temperature um, to update, which um, sometimes works, sometimes doesn't work immediately. It does always work, sometimes it's just a little delayed and I've got to figure that part out. But otherwise, all the original functions are there. You will see, I just updated up the uh, temperature for the passenger, you'll see that update in a second. There we go, see that? I'm going to uh, turn on the front defroster, that updates immediately. I can set the fan controls, it updates immediately. And I can turn off or on the automatic control, I can turn everything off. I can turn on the AC on and off. So, so far so good. Now an additional feature, which I don't think I demonstrated before, is the doors. Every single door will show up individually on the uh, panel, whether it's open or closed. See that? Which the original LCD did not do. It would show if a door was open, for example, if you open the front left door, it would show, hey, front left door is open. But it would not show each one independently. This one will show you. If two doors are open, it'll show you. If three doors are open, it'll show you. It'll show you which ones. So that's a fantastic option. Um, so yeah, my hope is to make perhaps a kit where you, available so you can upgrade your own. Um, I had to make a customized uh, socket so that it would connect to the original harness and that works just fine. And my uh, intention now is to add additional features such as a backup camera or um, proximity sensors. That'll be an interesting thing to add. I also want to redesign the uh, LCD, dis not the LCD. The output display, I mean, it is an LCD, it's a color LCD, not like the segmented one. I want to upgrade the display layout. Um, while this one you know, currently looks very similar to the original layout style, um, I have seen other layouts that might um, work a little bit better here. Also, uh, I have an Android radio, and I think it would be really cool if somehow these two could be connected, set up to interact with each other. I'm not sure how to do that yet. Um, it would definitely require some custom Android apps, um, communication. Also, I would like to add CAN bus features to get maybe in engine information. There shouldn't be any reason why I can't do that. So yeah, the now that the custom module is here, runs on a Raspberry Pi, runs on a Mega microcontroller that can interface, um, additional features can now be added. So yeah, I'm very excited now. Uh, where to go with this.